Here we've got 24 Ultra Prism booster packs. I like opening these, so hopefully we've got some good pulls in these. I bought them off eBay because they're going cheap in a an auction from a guy. I can't remember how much I bought them for. I think it's 24 packs for uh, 38 quid or something, so not bad. Oh, there we go, first pack. We've got Silver Valley GX. Make sure there's no sympathies at the back. The first hit. screen as well this time in the hits. Maybe show the hollows if there's enough space on it. Look her oh I just bought that off eBay because I needed it for my collection. Celestial La rest of the pack before I show you the card. I've just actually bought these as well from Chaos Cards. Perfect hard fit sleeves. As I've, I've had the perfect fit sleeves for years. But I just, I've got sent some cards from eBay in these hard sleeves. And ever since I've been wanting to buy some just to protect the cards even more. There we go. It doesn't seem to focus as much once it's in the sleeve. A bit weird. There we go. I'm going for about 10, 15 quid, I think. I'm eBay. In a minute. So not bad from some bulk, well, bulk packs that someone had left over on eBay. I mean, it is risky. People like to weigh the packs, but I don't think there's much in the way in of the packs. Give all type no. Shaman. Ah, oh, artwork. I wish that was a holler. It would look amazing. Got Ina. Evie. And there's a hollow. Keep seem to pull a lot of these out of the packs. I've had too many. Too, too many. Raquanid. So not bad. Definitely not weighed these properly if you are, if there is a weighing involved in this set. Which some YouTube people thought there was when the set first came out. The thing is with these hard sleeves is it's very difficult to get the card in without bending it or anything. I found out. I'll sort the bulk out after this. Make them into sets of 50. 
and sell them on eBay. And maybe sell the GXs or make it into a second master set and then sell that as well. The scoop board. Max. Cynthia, yes. I'll take that as a hit. I think I can sell that in a playset or alone. Usually sell them as a playset. Coming, not a rare hollow. Just got a few more packs here. See the edge of something? What's right on man? A Leafeon GX. Nice. I like the artwork on these GXs. The EV Evolutions. side. of those, but fleet guns. But yeah, I've got to crack them open out of the packs and then open the packs and holes. Packs within packs. GX Palkia. So yeah, not bad for not paying the booster box price and getting these on auction on eBay. It cuts a bit rubbish on that actually. At least it's a straight cut, I guess. So tight these sleeves. If there's a better way of putting them on, let me know. I've got about five packs after this one. That's nice. Ooh, looks rare. And a Cynthia. <laughs> Same amount of hits is what you get in a booster box, really, yeah. in these packs, so it's not been too bad. Ooh. Plus, I've had the two Symphys as well. Last pack, here we go. Oh, 
Oh, look a full art. Not too bad. Not too bad. I like the artwork on this, on the colours. Pulled a few of these though. Seem to be the common trainer in Ultra Prism set. Just have a look at the back. Seems to be a nice cut. Get that one in the sleeve. So yeah, 24 packs for about 38 quid off eBay. Not, not bad hits. And that one seems to be fitting on a lot better there. There we go, there's all the hits and all the bulk there. Come, I'll be opening these up in uh, the next video, so check that out. And also, I've got some, what's the new set? Forbidden Light. I've opened up a crate of Forbidden Light, so go check out those videos if you've not seen them already. And thanks for watching, guys.